Do I get my name and all that? Yeah. Okay. My name is Mike Duncan. I'm a role member of Round Valley Indian Tribes. I'm Concal, Wailaki, Wintun on my father's side. And I'm Western Bash Shoshone, Tomoke on my mother's side, and Filipino. Um, so I guess what I'm supposed to be talking about um, is how this, the Father's Sacred Curriculum has affected our community and how um, I was um, introduced to it. Uh, I've been doing this program here in Sacramento as a facilitator for the last five years. Um, well, a little five years now. And in the last five years or so, uh, we've have worked uh, with uh, over 250 men in this community of Sacramento, Sacramento California. Um, we've worked with men, women, families, and all through the curriculum. Um, tribes uh, vary. They come from Miwoks predominantly in this area. And uh, so we worked in Shingle Springs, Willow Rancheria, um, and that's an IL band of Miwoks. But also being an urban area, we have uh, Apaches, Choctaw, Cherokees, um, Chumash, uh, and Pom. I mean, we have tribes from all over here in Sacramento, uh, from all nations. <clears throat> so the, our program here in Sacramento is very unique. Um, we do uh, different cultural things. We have a, a, a drum, uh, but we also use, uh, when we make our necklaces, we use pine nuts, which is a, a more of a California way to make necklaces. So we just kind of learn and share each other's culture and our traditions with each other here in Sacramento. Um, our group is open to the community, so it's not uh, closed just to Native people and Native men. We have non-Native men that are raising children, Native children. No, we have non-Native men that um, don't have any children, so they just like to be in the group, or maybe the spiritual, or maybe the, the teachings that we do here. Um, like I said, I've been doing this here in Sacramento for the last five years. I've been in, uh, also have a group, group in Stockton, uh, California, and I do a group in San Jose, California. And those groups are a little bit smaller. You know, here in Sacramento, we have about between 12 to 18 men and women show weekly here. And they're a little smaller, maybe like seven to eight men, and uh, sometimes men and women show up. But they're pretty strong and powerful groups. The curriculum is very, very effective. Um, no matter where I take it, you know, in urban or in different in other areas, maybe uh, res and reservations or different rancherias, it's very effective. And how it, how it works is because it's culturally based. It, it, uh, the indigenous people in those in those parts they really they really gravitate to it. Um, you know, uh, teaching about choices, creator, talking about the creator God. You know, and, and learning to understand what prayer is, and going to choices and understanding what choices and. and we understand the barriers of being teachable and how those things affect our community and how important that we understand uh, how to be teachable and then we go into wisdom which is very important and of course service giving back giving back to our families and our communities that's always been our way so it's very important that we continue that that journey and carry those traditions on and we teach that to our families and our children and, our, and also our communities um, 